origin of uh, our new DCX series comes from the idea to rebuild one of our previous products that was the DCX uh, 50 and 52. The 354 was born because we see that the market not always needs uh, such a big component as the DCX 464, so we, we needed to scale it down. The very first constraint that we had uh, was uh, about the voice query size. So we first decided uh, which was the size of the mid uh, voice coil and the HF voice coil because uh, we didn't want uh, any compromises in the power handling that uh, our customer could use. This uh, relative size between the mid and the HF part uh, in uh, such a small uh, space uh, made uh, the path uh, design uh, quite tricky because uh, more you grow with the frequency, smaller are the wavelength. So it pretty soon starts to have interferences between the path. And uh, at the same time, we wanted a specific loading for both the path to have uh, a smooth and linear frequency response uh, for the mid and for the HF. This uh, brought us in uh, defining uh, new geometries for the new solution in the geometrical uh, shape uh, of the diaphragms in order to have uh, the good coverage uh, for the mid and for the HF size and the crossover area that uh, could be a little bit overlapped between the two to give uh, the user the freedom to uh, decide where to cross over. The, the, the two diaphragms. There are uh, many things to take into account uh, and many things that we discovered uh, on the field. So it's been the result of a team effort, uh, many simulation, many iteration uh, to have the good fit and the good uh, frequency response. The very first DCX, the 464, took uh, almost two years and uh, other two years for the small one. The device was thought at the beginning for line array application where these features are needed uh, and mainly the HF parts, uh, the output that we can get from the DCX uh, in the HF uh, is quite useful for, uh, for, for these systems. But we see from the market that it's been used uh, in uh, many different applications, long throat uh, system, uh, stage monitors, and really uh, wherever it it's needs uh, an high output uh, system uh, in a small package. So we see more and more requests uh, and we are happy with it uh, to see that people like uh, the concept uh, and they are finding many, many new system where to use it.